The knee, ankle and foot are weight-bearing joints and so are subjected to significant forces, rendering them susceptible to injury. Subjective examination of the knee, ankle and foot should provide the necessary information to plan the physical examination. We will present a number of physical examination techniques in a particular order, commencing with observations followed by active, passive and resisted movements, then joint specific or special tests, followed by accessory movements and finally palpation. However, the physical examination techniques selected and the order in which they are performed will vary from patient to patient. And this is dictated by the individual patient presentation, subjective examination findings, responses to the physical examination tests and the ongoing clinical reasoning process.